Warning, this is not a dramatization. Everything you're about to see is real. This is the story of how Harry met Wendy. Before we continue, I am very happy to share a little information about our sponsor for this video, Core Essentials. I've been trying out a Core track belt on our travels and must say this belt is certainly an innovative, comfortable design. Core track belts feature a hidden track with over 40 quarter inch adjustable sizing positions giving you the perfect fit every time. Core's quick release buckle simply locks into your precise waist size. Belts are available in full grain leather, top grain leather and nylon web. Core belts buckles use a patented spring-loaded mechanism that will never stick. With Core track belts, you can mix and match belts and buckles for all your daily needs. All Core belts carry a 30-day money-back guarantee and a full one-year warranty against defects, unusual wear, or breakage. Check out the link below and use coupon code HaircutHarry10 to get 10% off. Thank you, Core Essentials, for sponsoring this video. So we just stopped for a little break here in Harv to take a look and see what's around in this little town that has so much to offer like uh, Norm's sportswear and the Wells Fargo appears to be a really bubbling type of place to go and then I saw this thing here called the uh... can you see that? of oh, historical underground so we're going to see if we can go in and, and take a look here we'll see how much money it costs How's it going? Good. Is there a museum here? Yep, this there is, is the railroad museum. <laughs> the railroad. What about the underground thing? Yep, next tour is going to go out here at 2 o'clock. We can get you in on that one if you'd like. 2 o'clock, okay. It's a guided tour? It is. Is it okay to bring my furry friend? Unfortunately not. No furry Just, friends? Yeah, no furry friends. Okay. <laughs> we allow still still shots okay um, but just can no, I take a still no shot and no videos okay so we just had a quick little tour down in the underground they have a cool little uh, barbershop chair and stuff down there um, I guess if you're ever in Havre, which was apparently named somewhat after Le Havre in France, then you can go on the tour here um, at the uh, Havre Historical Underground Tour. So we just made it to Malta, Montana, not Malta in Europe, but Malta, Montana at uh, the barbershop we were kind of pinned down on a map when doing some research and it is Jerry's barber pole right here but we have a slight little situation go up here it's only open from 1 to 5 Tuesday through Friday and uh, tomorrow morning is tomorrow's Tuesday probably can't see much in there but uh, right now we don't have enough time to stick around to, to talk to Jerry tomorrow um, so sorry we missed you Jerry we'll see if we can catch you next time so we made it into Lewiston and uh, gotta find somewhere to eat and stuff but what I saw here was this funky I don't know if you can see that it is Victory Barber Shop. Looks kind of interesting in there, doesn't it? Uh, let's have a look. See if they uh, see if they let me take a couple of photos. See if they recognise me. Can push the door open. Hey, how's it going there? I kind of saw the shop from the outside and uh, kind of wandered in to take a quick look if that was okay. You're welcome. Sweetie. Okay. Did you read the sign outside? No, what did it say? Oh, there's a little plaque right outside. Uh huh. And this it talks about the, the, the buildings. Oh, nice. Yeah, you should go take a look at it. Okay. Yeah. How, how old is this shop here? Uh, this shop was opened in 1941. 41? Yes. Wow. And is it all original? It's Pretty, pretty much. much. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. I mean, you're not you're not original to no, the shop. I know. Good <laughs> yeah. 
No, it, uh, it was a, I'm the third owner. Oh, okay. So, yeah. How long have you had this one for then? Uh, nine and a half years. Wow. Wow. Yeah. So this is kind of debatable. Wendy actually does shaves over here. And if you look at my face, I need a shave. I'm going to check the outside and then... You should. I... Yeah, look at the plaques. And there's <laughs> plaques all over these old buildings. Oh, all right. And okay. it tells you, um, you know, when they were open, when they were started, the businesses, and what wow. they were before. So. Okay. Yeah, check them out. Okay, thank you. Okay. Thank you, Wendy. You're welcome. Do not touch, but they have everything yeah. in there. <laughs> oh, this is from uh, Civil War. Oh, wow. Yeah, That's and then that uh, okay, compass. That, that is not what you use for the no. right, right there, the shapes, no. <laughs> and then that's from a B-17 bomber. That's the that's the uh, the charger or something, yeah. It's a compass. Yeah, the compass, yeah. okay. Okay, thank you. You too. I'll, uh, I might be back in for a All shave, right, okay. Sounds good. Thank you. It's tempting, a 1960s original barbershop. I'll show you. Don't show it. Okay, what is this? Oh, right here. I'm, going, I'm being led into a dark room here. <laughs> oh, okay. You can see the creek that runs underneath town. Oh man, hang on, let's do this. Oh wow, that's, can you see? There's an actual river down there. That's the Spring Creek. It, it runs all the way underneath town. Usually there's a big old trout, but he's not sitting there. Oh no, I broke my thingy. <laughs> How do you break it? Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks. Have fun. Yeah. We're on the witness protection program. You are? <laughs> what are you protecting? <laughs> <laughs> That's Okay, hey, sorry, what was your name? You. My name is Britt. Britt? Yeah. Do you, do you have a YouTube channel? No. You're going to have to get one. Well, I want one of these rigs, though. Yeah. Is that, is that like, affordable? I um, the exact price. Probably four to five hundred bucks now. Okay. So, That's okay. yeah. It, considering they used to cost a couple of grand. Yeah. You know? Really. So, cool. Good luck. Man. Have fun. You as well. Yep. <laughs> okay, so lunch is over, and we're going to go back and ask them very, very nicely nice. if nice they will. Hey, have fun there. <laughs> We're gonna have a ask them very nicely if they'll do that for us. If I can open the door. Hi guys. Hey Wendy. What's up? Do you want to do a shave? Yes. Would you let us film it? Yes. Uh, yes. Are you live right now? Yes. Heck yeah, I am on Facebook. Facebook with a camera? YouTube. YouTube. You, so you're doing YouTube. No, no. Okay, so explain to me, you're doing YouTube. Yep. Okay, you tell me what you're, what's going on. Well, so you're here because of what? Barbershops across America? We're traveling around the US looking for barbershops to film at, but, okay, well, we're looking one. for, we're looking for authentic -y kind of looking ones. Right. Okay. And it looked like you picked this place up a few years ago and decided to keep it relatively exactly how it was. No, they waited for me. Okay, <laughs> that's even better. Same <laughs> haircut here. Yep, that's and um, and I mean most people when they buy it they rip it out and change it, you know. So I think that uh, there's some uh, kudos there for you for doing right. what you did. Gracias. Um, <laughs> And uh, so we film haircuts and shaves and things around the world, and then we stick them on our YouTube channel. That's cute. Love it. Are you, are, is that the reaction to the vacuum, or is that a reaction to That's the YouTube? Vacuum. Okay. It's not you to massage. <laughs> so we were very lucky because Wendy, right here, right there, <laughs> has graciously agreed to do a shave and possibly style the hair. Oh, so at least sure. I look somewhat halfway uh, yeah, less look <laughs> dorky. Yeah, that's my that's my normal look. So yeah. So we're gonna well, get set up and then. Away from his normal look. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna get set up and then do the shave, and I will be back afterwards. Up, so there we go. One clean shave, a nice little. Uh, Sprucing up on the on the hairdo there, courtesy of the Victory Barbershop, and um, you know where to go. As for us, we have to hightail it down to 
Butte, uh, I think it's Butte, Montana, uh, for, a, for an appointment tomorrow. So we're gonna hit the road with Repeat 2 and uh, catch you later.